So hello all guys, welcome to uh, one of my videos for today. Right now I'm trying to fix a 3D printer. Uh, Roll. Have you ever had the Foco 3D? I forgot the rest of the name, but uh, it's a Foco printer, 3D printer, and the uh, wheel is a little bit loose. That's what I'm trying to fix right now. So you see how it's supposed this this is not supposed to be coming out like that. It's supposed to be like this. Okay. Yeah, this this middle piece come out like that. It is not supposed to come out. From the plastic it's supposed to stay attached like this one you see it's supposed to stay attached so if you have a foco 3d printer and this this wheel is coming out that's not good you had to fix it that's what i'm trying to do right now so here we go so this is on the top this is the bottom it needs a washer You get it to hold the washer holding it against the uh, this tool, and then you keep twisting it until it's tight. All right, I think it's good. All right, so now is this this one too? Not done yet. Almost done though. Almost. This is the last wheel. 3D printer from Foco. They use cheap wheel, from what I heard, and that's why a lot of these wheel aren't working as it's supposed to be doing because the company using cheap wheel. And so it's not working correctly. Let's see if I can twist this out now. Twist this out, twist this out. All right. See. So these are the, all the cheaper screws. So they send you this pack. Well, they sent you a link, and then in the link they have these packets. And then just send them the uh, the order receipt and they'll refund you back. So I had to pay this first. And after the packet came, I had the invoice. I sent the invoice and this is how I came to have this extra wheels to fix this. I heard from a friend at my company. They say he's an expert in uh, 3D printing. He say if you feel lazy, you don't feel like fixing this like what I'm doing right here. You can uh, try to push them, push the focal coming just to replace you the whole new thing. It's annoying. It took me a while to get started going on this again. So the last month, it was like, I would say six, seven months ago. This printer was broken and uh, I I just kind of left the project there laying there. I, I So tonight was the only night that I feel like, oh, hey, you know what? I ordered a part. I ordered... This printer, why not just uh, start, you know, fixing it now. Today's the day. Start fixing this printer. You know, because I really want to print something from these three printers. See how it looks like. And uh, so far, I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos. They say that these 3D printer, a lot of people are making it into hobbies of printing small, uh, you know, Robot, small figurine. I don't know how fun that exciting that is. We'll see. I'm not sure I'd be interested in that, but just to see something different. All right. So it looks like it's tight. All right. So the wheel should be sturdy like this. It shouldn't be loose. And I replaced this one too already early on. So, all right, time to put this thing back together. I'm not, I don't know how I'm going to show you guys how to mount this, but let's see if I can do it with my camera. 